So we learned about SIP guest join. Yes, we did. And I understand, <laughs> you know, that MTRs are very popular. So how do those play into calling uh, point to point? Yeah, exactly. So, you know, the world has invested a lot in SIP. They've also invested a lot in MTRs. And prior to this relationship, those two worlds couldn't come together. Okay. So we are coming to market with our new point-to-point -point dialing for MTRs. So that is a license that you would put on all of your MTRs inside your environment right. that would allow those MTRs to directly dial a point-to-point -point call to a SIP device. So it's bridging these two worlds that never could collaborate. You could never bring value you know, from these two devices that couldn't talk to each other previously. Now you are bringing the ability for them to collaborate in a world that they didn't have access to prior. Um, we love a competitive differentiator. This is also a competitive differentiator. This is brand new software release and we're the only ones that have it in the market today. Fantastic. Hey Marty, so for this demonstration, I'm going to go ahead and talk about some of the new, one of the newest features that we have on the PECSIP service. And that's the ability to do a standard point-to-point -point call between a standards-based video endpoint and a Windows-based MTR. So within this environment, what I'm looking at is I have a competitive bar that I'm using for a camera and microphone hooked up to my Windows-based MTR in this room. So to place this call, it's actually very simple. All I have to do is go to the touch panel I have here, designate that I want to do a SIP call, and enter that standard SIP URI. So that once I hit dial on this pad, what's going to happen is that it is going to place an outbound call via Teams, which will be converted to SIP to the far end. So that once it's ready, the other side will then pick up and I can have a regular meeting with a standard space video endpoint for this call, all right? So additionally, what else we can do is that once the call is done, I can hang up, but if for some reason the other side needs to call me back or they need to reach back to me or in general, the opposite, the call in the opposite direction, I can have that endpoint dial back out using a simple URI. That endpoint will dial that, dial that standard SIP call, it will reach out, and reach this MTR. So all I have to do is answer it on this side, and I can now have a point-to-point -point call with that standard space endpoint. So that really shows the flexibility of what you can do within the MyPexup service and really how the PexUp service works well within a mixed environment. All right. Brian, thank you so much for your time today and those fantastic demonstrations. Really appreciate it. And Lauren, thank you for coming into the office Thanks today. Thanks for having me. Really great. Uh, we're super excited about this partnership, if you can't tell. And <laughs> so um, please join us again on other video series demonstrations. And if in the meantime, if you have any questions, please reach out to us uh, directly. Thank you.